how'd you get here? I've had my eye on this sucker for a little bit now. This is Sonic, uh, Aural? Sonic Oral? I, okay, look, I'm gonna say, <laughs> I'm gonna say this with all the love and compassion that I know how. If this game's name is Sonic Oral, guys, what happened? <laughs> what happened? Like, I get it, it looks really pretty, and when I saw that, I didn't immediately make the connection, and then I read it out loud, I was like, Sonic Oral, alright, let me- Wait a second. <laughs> Let me write that one down. Wait, say that one more time. Uh, it is, it's insane. Okay, but let's talk about the actual game itself instead of just poking fun at the name because I don't, it's easy. It's easy content, all right? Let me fucking just say whatever I want and get away with it. <laughs> That's such a pretty shield, dude. What? Dude, this is dope. This is insane. Okay, so frame one, we gotta talk about the visuals here because they are stunning. This is one of the most beautiful classic Sonic fan games I've ever seen. And that's insane, dude, because there's so much competition out there right now. There's so many fan games that are trying to take the cake as the most beautiful thing you've ever laid your eyes upon. But no, 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 no. Sonic Oral is here. <laughs> or no, I'm, just, <laughs> I'm sorry. I need to let it go. I need to let it go. It's not that funny. I mean, <laughs> it's kind of funny if you really think about it. Fuck. Anyways, what am I saying? Fuck off, my middle school brain. Let me actually let me play the game and do shit. Um, Sonic Oral. Really, really, really pretty, and I, I wanted to play it simply because of that, because a lot of these, uh, these Sonic fan games that, uh, look super pretty tend to have some pretty interesting level design to talk about, too, because they get a lot of cool people on board. The only, and this is gonna be such a, a, a small issue in the grand scheme of things, because it is genuinely gorgeous. The only issue that I'm having so far after playing this is that it is a little difficult to tell exactly where you're going, uh, because in a lot of cases, the foreground is just as vibrant and just as detailed and just as beautiful as the background. And I know that sounds like a, a, a non-issue, like, oh no, the background's pretty. But if the background is too pretty and too well put together and too much uh, like the the front sprites, it can get a little confusing. So when I was running through that stage there a little bit, I was having a hard time uh, figuring out where exactly I was going, which is why I was uh, on the lower path for a lot of the time. It's not because I'm dog shit, guys. I, I, I swear it's not because I'm dog shit. I swear. Stop. Stop leaving mean comments. I swear to God. Um, but it was a little bit difficult. But uh, overall, dude, it's so pretty. Dude, it's so pretty. Sonic Sprite too, bro. What? <laughs> it's so pretty. That's all I have in my brain right now. That's the only word I can think of. When I see it, it's like when you see a really pretty lady on the street and she comes up to you and she's like, what's up, big dick? And you're like, pretty. And that's all you can say. And she's like, ugh, never mind. I thought you were going to say something super cool. Like, do you want to go out to dinner with me tonight? And you just got to sit there and be like, I, 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 uh, 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 pretty. Uh, uh. That's what this game does to me, man. This game is gorgeous. Don't, don't know this background is fucking stunning. This back, what are you? Oh my God. What were they cooking? What did they, what were they cooking? Cause I want them back in the kitchen right now. I want them back. KFC, remember when they did that really dog? I swear to God, this is going to circle back around. <laughs> remember when they did that really dog shit, um, th like marketing scheme for their uh, program that was trying to create more female chefs? And it, it, uh, it <laughs> for lack of a, a better, there's no tactful way of saying this. Because uh, KSC, they, they, they really screwed the pooch on this one. Um, th it was like a women belong in the kitchen joke um anyways <laughs> that relates to my sonic video because uh i would say that these creators belong in the kitchen rather than an entire group of people which i think is a little bit less problematic personally uh i i feel like my my take on that uh, would is just a little bit less damning <laughs> Oh my god, this shit is so pretty. And dude, okay, I will say, something I'm noticing that's really working about the level design, when I fall down to a lower path, because I'm doing that a lot, guess what? The flow still doesn't stop. Because, okay, there are a lot of uh, Sonic fan games that do this kind of wrong, 
where the lower path, yes, it's meant to be a punishment, but it's not meant to make the level feel like actual ass, even if you're on the lower path. The lower path should still be fun, but it should be less fun and less rewarding than the top path. Does that make sense? This so far, I have barely noticed that I'm on the bottom path. And when I do end up going to the lower path, because I do some dumb shit like that, I still end up going really f at, like a decent speed through the level. And I still feel like even though I am tackling slower platforming challenges on the whole, right? I'm still getting so much speed and momentum and it's not stopped by falling down to the lower path i think that's my big takeaway the speed isn't stopping when i go lower and that's i think that's what's working really well for me right now with this level design even though i'm screwing the pooch heavy because i'm having a hard time seeing like where these like jump quick sections are popping up uh, i'm still having such an amazing time because it's just so easy to get immediately back into the flow of it, immediately back into the spin of it, and it gives you more chances to show off your prowess even when you're on the lower path. That's something that so many classic Sonic fan games get wrong, and then people are like, okay, well, there's the lower path. Oh, these don't work yet, but it's really pretty. <laughs> it's really pretty. I have to say, I think the thing that's blown me away the most so far just, okay, because I've seen a lot of gameplay of this because I, I looked at the trailer and I was like, oh, fuck yeah. So I saw a lot of the baseline gameplay for it. I didn't see the shield, bro. That's such a good sprite. Oh my God, he's so expressive, dude. Oh my God, this is so good. This is what, what oh, this is so good. I'm actually blown away. I am, I'm actually blown away. It, it okay. Ooh, classic Sonic fan games have a lot of really tough competition, and there are a lot of people doing this type of gameplay style so right. So having a, a classic Sonic fan game that doesn't add any, like, crazy new abilities or whatever, having this blow me away, it actually is, like, it, it, it kind of wowed me that it wowed me so much. This game is amazing. Please play Sonic Oral. <laughs> Oral. <laughs> Oh my god.